Prince Andrew is widely regarded to be the Queen's favourite son. There will be a great deal of change ahead for the young royals and their titles in the years to come. The great-grandchildren of the Queen will have several different titles and styles in their lifetimes, some of which carry a huge historical and political importance. While Prince George and Princess Charlotte will eventually take on some of the most senior royal titles, their younger brother Prince Louis is expected to carry a title that has a great personal significance to the Queen. Prince Louis Arthur Charles was born on April 23, 2018 at St. Mary's Hospital in Paddington and lives with his family in apartment 1A of Kensington Palace. His current and official title is His Royal Highness Prince Louis Arthur Charles of Cambridge, and he sits fifth in line to the throne. But this will all change when his grandfather becomes the king. From the first day that Prince Charles is the king to the day where his father, Prince William, has his official Prince of Wales ceremony at Carnarvon Castle, he will be known as HRH Prince Louis of Cornwall and Cambridge. The addition of Cornwall to the title comes from the most senior dukedom which is held by the Prince of Wales. Following Prince William's official title change to the Prince of Wales, Prince Louis and his siblings will become Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis of Wales. It is as of yet unclear whether the children who currently use Cambridge as their last name will follow in their father's footsteps and use Wales as their surname at school, for example, Lewis Wales. But looking even further ahead into the future, Prince Lewis would be in line to inherit a historic dukedom when he marries. Much in the same way that his father was made the Duke of Cambridge and his uncle Prince Harry was made the Duke of Sussex on his wedding day, Lewis could one day be the Duke of York. The current holder of the title is Prince Andrew, so it would be unavailable to Lewis if Andrew was still alive when he chooses to marry. Traditionally the Duke of York title has been given to the monarch's second oldest son, so if Prince William is on the throne, and it is vacant, then Prince Louis will likely take on that style. Previous Dukes of York include the Queen's grandfather, King George V, and her father, King George Vi, meaning she was known as Princess Elizabeth of York until her father became the king in 1936, so there are several significant sentimental links for the Queen. The Queen also opted to give the title to Prince Andrew who is widely regarded to be her favourite son, when he married Sarah Ferguson in 1986. Prince Louis's older brother is also set for a huge title change when their father is king. Prince George is in line to become the Prince of Wales and would be the 28th incumbent following in the footsteps of his grandfather Prince Charles and father Prince William. This title is traditionally given to the eldest daughter of the monarch and is the highest honour that can be bestowed upon a female member of the royal family by the sovereign. This title is traditionally given to the eldest daughter of the monarch and is the highest honour that can be bestowed upon a female member of the royal family by the sovereign.